Hey, hey, hey! Look at this tiny lens. It goes inside your eye to make your world brighter and more crisp. This is called the implantable columnar lens or implantable contact lens. All about this and more as we go into this deep dive. So what exactly is ICL surgery? A conventional contact lens sits on top of your eye to bend light properly. But imagine we take this lens and put it inside your eye, between your iris and your lens. Of course, it's not the same contact lens you wear every day. It's a specialized lens specifically made to sit inside your eye made up of a biocompatible material called columnar. It's a revolutionary form of vision correction for those who may not be candidates for traditional laser surgeries like LASIK or PRK due to thin or weak corneas. This procedure is reversible, meaning if you don't like your vision after, we can always remove the lens. Let's talk about who might be a good candidate for ICL surgery. Firstly, ICL is ideal for those with moderate to high levels of nearsightedness, especially if you've been told that your corneas are too thin for LASIK. It's also a great option for those with astigmatism as the lens can be designed to correct this common issue. It can reduce anywhere from minus 3 to minus 15 diopters of spherical and 4 diopters of astigmatism. But I bet now you're wondering, what if you're above minus 15 diopters? Well, you could still get the ICL surgery, but it won't get you to zero. It'll reduce your numbers and your dependence on those thick glasses. And if you're someone who's looking for a reversible option, ICL might be the right choice for you. Unlike LASIK, which permanently alters the shape of your cornea as essentially you burn the tissue off the top, the ICL can be removed or replaced if your vision changes over time. Age is another factor to consider. Typically candidates for ICL are between the ages of 21 and 45 with stable vision for at least one year. Lastly, we have to measure for something called the anterior chamber depth. It tells us if this lens will fit inside your eye. See the front part of your eye known as the anterior chamber is quite small so we have to make sure it can fit the lens safely. It should be at least 3 millimeters to be eligible. However, the best way to determine if you are a candidate is through a thorough eye examination. Let's dive into some of the key advantages of the standout choice for vision correction. First and foremost, ICL provides exceptional visual clarity and sharpness. Many patients report experiencing crisp, clear vision shortly after the procedure, often surpassing the quality of vision they had with glasses or traditional contact lenses. In fact, the higher order aberrations in ICL surgery are better than those in LASIK, which means a relatively better night vision. Another significant benefit is the minimal risk of dry eyes. Unlike LASIK, which can sometimes exacerbate dry eye symptoms, ICL surgery does not involve altering the corneal surface. This means that the corneal nerves are never disturbed. This makes it an excellent option for those who suffer from dry eye syndrome. Although, that doesn't mean it's completely safe in that regard and screening for dry eye is still important. UV protection is built directly into the ICL material, offering an added layer of defense against harmful UV rays. This is a unique feature that not only corrects your vision, but also helps protect your eye health. Lastly, the flexibility and reversibility of ICL surgery are major advantages as the structure of the eyeball is never changed. If your vision changes over time or if you decide you want to explore other options in the future, ICL can be removed or replaced, providing a peace of mind and adaptability. Let's dive into the procedure of ICL surgery. The process is quick, minimally invasive and typically takes about 20 to 30 minutes per eye. Both eyes are not done in the same sitting and are usually done one week apart. First, you'll undergo a thorough pre-operative evaluation to determine the correct size and power of the ICL. This involves detailed measurements of your eye shape and size including your refraction. Then, depending on the surgeon, the optimal size requires the white to white which basically gives the size of your cornea or a sophisticated ultrasound is used to measure the inner sulcus measurements. The size of the lens is crucial to a successful procedure. A small lens can touch the lens and cause cataracts, and a big lens can occlude your angle and cause glaucoma. The surgeon will make a small incision, usually less than 3 millimeters, at the edge of your cornea. The incision is so small that it's self-sealing and typically doesn't require stitches, just like in cataract surgery. 
Next comes the exciting part, the implantation of the ICO. The lens, folded like a tiny taco, is inserted through the incision and gently unfurled into position between your iris and your natural lens. It's a delicate dance that requires precision and skill. Once the lens is in place, the surgeon will make any necessary adjustments to ensure it's perfectly positioned. And just like that, the procedure is complete. You will be given post-operative instructions and eye drops to prevent infection and inflammation. The recovery process is relatively quick. Many patients notice an improvement in their vision almost immediately, with further enhancements over the following days and weeks. Now that we've explored the procedure, let's talk about life after ICL surgery. This is where the magic happens as the patients begin to experience the world through a new lens, quite literally. The recovery period is relatively short and most patients are able to resume their normal activities within just a few days. You may be prescribed eye drops to prevent infection and reduce inflammation during the initial healing phase for about a month. One of the most remarkable aspects of life after ICL surgery is the rapid improvement in vision. Many patients report seeing clearly almost immediately after the procedure, with vision continuing to stabilize and improve after the following weeks. The quality of vision often described as crisp and sharp. This is especially noticeable in low light conditions when compared to something like LASIK surgery. Long-term satisfaction rates amongst ICL patients are impressively high. The lens is designed to be a permanent solution, providing lasting clear vision. However, with even all these advantages, regular checkups with your eye care professional are important to monitor the health of your eyes and the position of your lens. With proper care and monitoring, the ICL can provide a lifetime of clear vision. And that folks concludes the video of the ICL surgery. If you like this video and would like to see even more eye related content, please give us a like and subscribe.